Hello everybody coming at you with all my might. It is my how you guys doing today? Um, just going to take the Cena Prism out for a little test ride. I never uh, never really got to do just a vlog on the Cena. Cena alone that is. And we're going to turn my gas on to on instead of reserve. There we go. Yeah, I never never tried it really um, we're gonna try the audio and see how it works I know right now I have the uh, right now I have the external mic and well the internal mic as in the uh, I'm in neutral <laughs> I have the internal mic on the uh, Cena itself I know I did a little bit of testing already for uh, for it on and uh, it uh, was definitely a little different like it's too quiet you can't hear without the uh, you can't hear the bike sounds so I just want to see wind noise so I'm gonna do a little cruising a little bit here in between working ah, I got a spider web in my face that always sucks <laughs> ah, it's too high. There we go. T Dub's all jetted up right, it runs phenomenally. Really happy about that. Definitely testing out the wind noise right now. But I also want to see how the audio sounds. I never, um, I never, never got really the chance to just test it um, by myself. I know when you're with other Cenas, it uh, picks up all the little background noises, you know, that you do get over the Cena intercom. So it's, I don't know. Maybe I have unbelievably high standards, but it kind of throws me off a little bit just because of the fact that it does that. I don't know. I'm used to hardwired GoPros, which for ease of access, ease of use, seen it all the way. But I think you may you will get a better quality with a hardwired mic, that's for sure. But then you also have a mic in your helmet that you have to worry about. With this, you have to have two things on and recording at the same time. But on the other hand, this you're seeing it last for a long time. The headset, that's my SMH10 will last for a long time, the battery life. The Cena Prism lasts about two hours. So you have full audio whenever that's recording. Now if something were to malfunction, you could temporarily lose audio, but that that is with everything. There's yet to put malfunctioning in the, the picture, but being though this is Bluetooth, I have had it lose connection when we were with other people, as that's when it had that problem. But other than that, you know. I haven't really gotten the chance to do a lot of testing on it. I've been really busy. So I just wanted to rip around on here, just test some video, test some audio. I have other videos that I did do that I want to do a little bit more testing on. But yeah, we'll have to see how it turns out. I'm sure it'll be fine, but. And what you have to let me guys, you guys will have to let me know what you think of it too. Like, how does it compare to the GoPro? I mean, you all know my GoPro audio. What, which one you like best? But for easy to use, I, I would definitely give the Cena props, just because it's so much simpler. I mean, the mounts too. The mounting's good. 
you can get the good angles without, you know, having a bunch of crazy looking arms. But, you know, some people have their arms set up that are pretty good too, but now let's not get soaked in the mud. It's been actually a little bit since I've been out and actually rode, but I have to get back to the house. We're working on a bike, but I wanted to get out and rip a little bit. Knock a little bit of rust off. Run the bike a little bit. And do some testing. So I get to do everything. And this concludes our test. Thank you for watching and subscribe. Hope that's today. Uh, let me know what you think. And I'll catch you all later. God bless.